Hello, this is Gupteshwar Rao from the digital teacher dot in. Now I'm going to explain you along with a beautiful animation, the working function or the functioning of an electric motor wherein Fleming's left hand rule was incorporated. Now I'm sharing the screen for the benefit of your uh, looks uh, for the benefit of yourself uh, so that you will understand clearly what I am explaining. Uh, so, now here is the simulation which I am showing. On the left hand side, you see that the Fleming's left hand rule which uh, indicates the positions of the three fingers, the thumb, the first finger and the second finger, which are at right angles to each other. The thumb representing the, uh, in which M is to be taken as uh, the motion of the conductor, F to be taken as uh, the force and C to be, in the second finger, C to be taken as the flow of the current. The current, okay. Now, it says that, the Fleming's left hand rule says that if a current carrying conductor is allowed to pass, is allowed to be in a magnetic field, it gets deflected. And it de the motion depends on the uh, position, the uh, on the direction of the current. So now here on the right hand side, you see the motor the cross section wherein the two these two on the the black ones are the gray ones are the magnetic uh, north pole and the south pole and then there is a current carrying conductor inside which is wounded round and then this is the current through which this is the wires through which the current flows now what happens when you apply a current now let us see we apply a current here see this is the magnetic this is the motion the motion of the current is towards the thumb the motion of the uh, the deflection of this carrying conductor is towards the thumb okay now the direction of the field is towards this side the current is uh, towards this side see it goes and then now what happens when you reverse the current when you reverse the current, you will see that the deflection will be on the the opposite direction. Okay, so we apply. Now you see the same rule. The same rule follows the Fleming's left-hand rule, which explains the motion of the electric conductor will be along the direction of the thumb. Okay, and. Uh, uh, this is how it works. I'm now showing you the full Now see this is the North Pole. This is the South Pole and then if I reverse the current apply remove the current it stops Apply the current in the reverse direction the electric lines are forced towards this side the current is flowing like this Okay so this is how the electric motor works.